Millions of restorations have been made with component materials in the last 10 years, and then Supply the Tray is a leading company worldwide with the brand Direct. Components are often the material of choice in the daily surgery for patients who need extra care. This case presents a quite common clinical situation, for cervical margins due to abrasions and gingival recession. There is enough substance loss to justify class 5 fillings with direct extra. The first stage consists of very carefully cleaning all the surfaces to which the adhesive will be applied. We are using the well-known prophylaxis past Nupro that is very effective to remove any unsightly discoloration. We reveal the enamel on all teeth to be treated using a red ring avoid diamond burr. The burr is held at 45 degrees and the avoid shape gives a good view of the preparation limit, but also a sufficiently instrumented surface that ensures good adhesion and avoids secondary discoloration. To complete these three fillings, we chose not to use a rubber dam, but instead use a retraction cord that is inserted around each preparation, so that we avoid any leakage of gingival fluid. It will also prevent the adhesive to going into the sulcus. The cord is not impregnated to avoid any interaction with the adhesive materials and is simply inserted into the labial margin. Here is the last preparation on the most medial tooth, the canine, using our cord that we must insert carefully to avoid any bleeding. The shade is selected and, by looking at the natural teeth, we can see that the canine is more pigmented than the premolars. We select the shade with reference number A35 for the canine and A3 for the premolars of the direct extra material. The adhesive system used here, Xeno 3, is a single step self-etching material. This feature is particularly beneficial in this type of situation where we have dentine that is not very permeable and rather sclerotic. It also ensures that the adhesive system penetrates well into the enamel to seal it properly. The adhesive is applied very carefully and we reinforce its penetration by rubbing the surfaces gently with the applicator tips provided by the manufacturer and we do not rinse. We evaporate the solvent immediately by a gently air blow, thus avoiding any contamination of the dental surfaces. The adhesive is carefully polymerized tooth by tooth before dispensing the filling material. We start by filling the premolars and we select the shade A3. The first layer allows us to sensitively rebuild the second premolar. The material is applied under steady pressure to avoid any air inclusion within the resin. Each increment is light cured. There will be excess material at this stage that can be removed with finishing burrs. It is important to ensure that we place enough material in the cervical area, since this will affect the cosmetic appearance. A spatula is used for all these operations. You can note how easy it is to apply the material and that it does not stick to the instrument. 
We are here working here without any matrix system. In certain education, this would be particularly beneficial when having to place several layers with several shades on one tooth. On tooth 24, we proceed in the same way, placing material with pressure, and because of the thin nature of the marginal gingival, we take care to avoid any excess here, to avoid creating retention zones that would be irritating to the soft tissue. 